Hey good people, welcome back to Extremely Modest. In today's video, I will be giving you some step-by-step -step tips on how to layer your bed and how to make it look and feel comfortable. In the first clip, you saw me adding a mattress pad cover. Adding a mattress cover not only helps protect your mattress, but if you purchase one with a little filling, it does give you an extra padding to help you sleep a little more comfortably throughout the night. After your mattress cover, you will add your fitted sheet. A little trick that I use is to first grab the end with the tag and that will go on the bottom right side of the bed. Finding a good sheet set is also important when making your bed look and feel comfortable. A good sheet set to me provides a super soft and silky feel, something that's not too thick, but also thick enough for me to feel comfortable throughout the night. Next, you want to lay your flat sheet on top of your fitted sheet, making sure both sides are even. If you have a printed sheet set, try layering your printed side face down so when you fold your sheets down, your printed side will be displayed. Making my bed, part of the reason for me that makes it look and feel comfortable is making sure that everything is neatly tucked underneath the mattress. I'm using this method called the hospital fold and that's just neatly folding my quilt and my sheets underneath my mattress. If this is your first time joining, welcome and thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Let me introduce myself. My name is Lavion and I enjoy posting motivational cleaning, home decor, and organization videos. If this type of content keeps your interest, please consider subscribing. And to my returning subscribers, thank you all for your continuous support. So next in layering, you'll see that I've added this super comfy quilt set. It's called the Chanel Stitch Velvet Quilt Set. I actually found it at Target. And everything that I use today, guys, will be linked down below in the description box if you are interested in purchasing anything that I use today. And I will just then fold my flat and my quilt down on the bed, and that just adds for an uh, extra layered look. I'm spraying this pillow spray now just for the purpose of this video on how to make your bed look and feel comfortable but I usually spray it on our pillows just before bed and it just helps us with unwinding and relaxing just before bedtime. I'm also going to use this envelope fold on the pillowcases just for a neater and tighter look.
Adding a duvet or comforter to the end of the bed and folding the comforter into two or three parts does help with a full layered look. I purchased this duvet from Z Gallery and I feel like I definitely got my money's worth. What I did for the winter months was just added in a thicker comforter on the inside. Although we typically don't sleep with the duvet, the sheets and the quilt does a pretty good job with keeping us warm, but just having the duvet at the end of the bed does come in handy on those colder nights. Lastly, I'm adding this throw blanket as a runner at the end of the bed just for decorative purposes and to add some texture on my bed. But this throw blanket will come in handy when you're just relaxing in bed and you just need something nice and cozy to cover up in. This concludes this video on how to layer and make your bed look and feel comfortable. I hope that you have enjoyed this video. Now I do understand for most making your bed is just not your thing, but keeping your most intimate space clean, smelling good, and clutter free all helps you to relax and prepare you for your days and tasks ahead. Your bed should be your most comfortable place in your home. And just by taking a little extra steps to make it look and feel comfortable is something that I like to do. Thank you, thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe and until next video guys bye bye Kinda new, Ooh. tell me you're feeling it too. Ooh. And love.